everybody, and welcome to the next part of Teleglitch. I'm just going to dive right into it, since uh, chances are you're probably boom, uh, watching these consecutively. It's just a little loud. Let's see. So, uh, let's uh, make sure I've got something useful out. Just like, okay, some canned meat, not bad. I don't have any room for it. Well, let's check what this is. Storage cabinets. Okay, so now I at least know where those are. Which are... So this map's another big one. <laughs> we are in the military software sector, though. I'm hoping to find more microchips here. So that hurts. And owned. So, <laughs> uh, if only I hadn't had to reload. So that was literally uh, the fastest uh, level ever. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I was really hoping to make it further. But yeah, I guess that was just not on the cards this time. Sometimes after you've tried really hard and failed, you feel like giving up. The cool thing about life is that it's okay to give up. It is totally okay. But it's also totally okay to keep trying even harder. The really hard thing about life is making a choice between these two. So our overall stats for this game are 61% actually. I'm actually okay with that. We found 7 secrets, 34 items, and we got 4 monsters in the void. We killed a crap ton of stuff, basically. An epic crap ton. Um, so since right now we're about a minute and 57 seconds into the video, uh, let's look at some of the stuff. So we've uh, discovered most of these things. Uh, there's still one missing, but I'm curious. Uh, we'll find it eventually. We've got most of the explosives here. Um, two of these yellow things are missing. Uh, we found all the basic uh, healing. Uh, by the way, if you click on these, it gives you this nice pop-up that uh, it has some extra information about it down here, so it would seem, but the real information is right there. So you can say it tells you what uh, what it all takes, basically. Um, and for yes, for those of uh, those that you have crafted, it actually tells you what it takes to craft them. So I imagine, or all the, it's not just uh, it's not just that; it's also all the. Uh, all the stuff you can make with it. So you can see there's two things I've yet to actually make that include the hardware, but I'm pretty sure that uh, one of those is definitely... Okay, I see with the machine gun. So I'm gonna guess that one of these is the rifle HV, and one of these I know is the auto pistol. But yeah, this way uh, I can basically, you can basically look at all the uh, all the things actually really cool. We've gotten, eh, it looks about 75%, which is pretty good if you ask me. If you look at our monsters, we've also seen quite a few. This is uh, one of those squids, medium armored, zombie a welder, that's one of the guys that killed us. Now where's the destroyer? Do we get to see that? I guess it's got to be here somewhere. Alright, so you have the black lab coats, or I guess they're Whatever they were, the black clothes, what I thought was a guard, but black uh, coated was actually a scientist. Yeah, I don't actually see the destroyer, which is uh, what actually wrecked us mostly in that run. It took two of our lives. But yeah, um, overall stats are actually, uh, if you can see I've died five times, uh, that would actually be, should be more than five. I guess maybe I played one time really quick and died before I th you know, really learned much, but still overall, considering I went from barely beating the, f the, the fourth level to getting all the way to the eighth, uh, I really don't have any complaints, so yeah, I'm actually really happy with the way this turned out. Hopefully uh, you guys have learned some stuff. As you can see, I can now start at level 5 if I so choose which is pretty cool but yeah 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm really disappointed that that ended up being so short. Uh, I'm probably just going to start recording another run right now because uh, I got home and I was like, I want to record some telly, bitch. I'd, I'd really like to record some telly, bitch. I was not expecting a squid to be the first thing out the door. Ah, oh well. <laughs> I guess I'll just call it for the video at this point then. Because uh, there's nothing else I can do, but uh, hopefully uh, you guys enjoyed it. If you really did, um, you know, go ahead, like, favorite video, subscribe if you want to see more. All that pandering for YouTube followers, which you know I, I appreciate it. Uh, I never understood it until I had to do it, but uh, it makes sense, I guess, a little bit since uh, you know I really like it when people comment on the videos and learn stuff. And you know, it sounds corny, but it's true. But yeah, uh, hopefully I'll be releasing another run pretty soon, and I hope to see you guys then.